Gaming Command Center. I'm your host, Spencer. <laughs> Today, I am back with you guys at Stars of the What going on? Oh, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to decorate your stronghold in case you didn't know or if you haven't played Star Wars yet. Okay. We do not need to throw snowballs at people like Dave Revealer. Snowball! Ha! Huh. Alright. This is my stronghold. Uh, I like it, I guess. I gotta get some extra stuff. But anyway, I'm gonna tell you guys how to do this stuff. Basically, if you guys turn your attention up here to the right of the screen, I can click into here to edit mode. And when you go into edit mode, this is what you're gonna come up with. It looks confusing, but it's not. After a while. <laughs> what you're gonna do here is, you, you know, I noticed, you notice how I put all my stuff down. Well, that's because what you do is, let's just take this for example. This purple thing right here. Big purple. We'll call it big purple. Big, big purple. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to click on this. So you're going to click on it, and most likely you're going to come up with, uh, you're going to come up with this. You have to flick through all this stuff, figure out what else I want, and then you, go, you flick through and you go, oh, hey, I bypassed something. No, I don't want that there. I don't want that there. And you gotta flick through. So what you're gonna do? Instead of having all this fuss, you're just gonna go and show available. It shows you what's available for this purple square. So what's yeah. available is an older on yeah. throne. And we'll yeah. just take this for example in, in arrangement, uh, basic lounge. So this is all this stuff. I'm going mid. All right. So yeah, I got my yeah. <laughs> So, um, right here, this is just, you, you put it here, you can do Y offset, or uh, X offset, Y offset, you can rotate the thing, however you want it. But you just put it there, it's easy as that. However, it gets a little bit more tricky. So what you're going to do, is you go into layout, and to change it into these different squares, let's just say medium block, and then narrow and small cross, narrow and small cross large standard arrangement which is the normal small narrow cross and then medium and narrow columns so we'll just do medium and narrow columns for now and then show available so all this stuff is available here so we got a cantina uh, bar setup and cantina bar cabinet I I now, hey, I'll take it. Yeah. there we go you know you got all this stuff you can yeah. place it where however you want it you can like I said, X offset, Y offset, rotation. That's a big. That's, whatever that's you want to do. Hit, so that's pretty much what you can do. Oh, it makes it everything super easy. You doing the layouts and, or the show available makes everything really easy because then you can see what you're looking at. But I'm actually just gonna change this back really quick here. Alrighty. So let's take you down here, and you're probably, you're probably wondering right now why or how the heck is he getting these decorations. I have no idea how to get them, depending on if you've played Star Wars or not. <laughs> uh, Alright, so see this decoration merchant? Well, you just come in here, uh, if you got a little bit of credits, you can go buy something, so let's see, Rishi Basket, you got, basically you got all the stuff, if you hit control and then left click it, it'll show you what, what, what you're looking at. So there's that. Let's control left click, uh, basic metal chair, and it just shows you. So control left click on your mouse. Really easy. See? Easy. Yeah, I can do this all day. Except for I really don't want to. <laughs> so it's easy as easy is that. So but then there's more, you know, you can't that can't be it, you know, little things, just little credits. Well no. If you come up here to the cartel market, which I will get into in another video, you have like that Wampa rug and stuff. You have the Life Day Bundle, which costs a thousand cartel coins, which I had. Uh, but I just, you know, you get all this stuff in here and who do whatnots. But that is pretty much how I got all my decorations. But of course, there has to be more than that. There can't just be those couple things. Well, you go into decorations, you go to three or four or five, whatever. Yeah, as you can see, they have all the Stronghold Essential Bundles. So the Stronghold Spacer Decoration Bundle, Republic Essential Bundle. They have actually a, like an Empire Essential Bundle, which I think I passed. Ooh, a red... I might buy that sometime. Huh. 
you know, and you can buy all the, you can get all this stuff, all the cool looking things. Alright, so, that's basically how you get the decorations. Now, let's just go down, I'm just going to head down here and give you guys a little tip here. You see this rug? Okay. You can only put down this rug if you have this glowing thing here in the middle. Right there. Only that. And you have to click it. If you don't click that or you don't click anything else, you are not going to be able to put down a rug. No matter how long you... I did it for like... I tried to put it down, put down my womp rug upstairs or up the elevator uh, for like two hours. It took me forever. And I clicked on the thing on accident and I was like, whoa, hey, I can do this. And then I figured it out. So anyway, this is, whoa, that was weird. So this is pretty much what I got here. I got the Imperial flag. It's just for the re very reason that uh, I don't have a lot of Republic flags. I only have one. It's actually up there in the corner. Um, and yeah, this is uh, all the stuff I got. I got a palm tree, a galactic market, which if you don't know what that is, we'll get into it in another video. I got a mailbox right next to it, just in case. A couple of casino tables, uh, or not casino. Why do I always say casino? Oh, that's probably because that's what they're called. Yeah, I think that's what they're called. But it's a cantina uh, thing. And I got the, the set up here, the cantina bar, you know, what, whatnot. And then the centerpiece. The tree. You get that in the thousand uh, cartel coin uh, life date bundle. And yeah, that's pretty much what I got down here. And you probably saw these robots, big ones. You go into here, and this is the industrial fabric droid. So basically, as you can see, the, this just buying an ammunition canister from this guy costs one industrial prefab mark two. Sounds confusing. I will have to get into that some other time because we don't have a lot of time left in this video. <laughs> but anyway, I just, these lights actually aren't aren't already there. I, I put those there. They, I just kind of noticed that they they looked like they're supposed to be there, but they're not. Uh, but yeah. So this is pretty much what I got down here. You know, cantina. Oh yeah, the cantina uh, symbol right up there. The cantina thing. One Republic flag, unfortunately. All my pets lined up. Okay, middle slot. You know? And I got something up here. One last thing you guys might want to see. Oh, yeah, it's a little bedroom. I just kind of slapped it in there. I was like, hey, that'd be cool. Over here, I got like a, uh, I put down like a hospital army camp. So I got like a merchant stall here, you know? So I just slapped this merchant stall on the big square this on one of the me or like not medium it's more of a yeah it's a floor medium narrow uh to put down this little rack here ah and i got two guards um uh, some hospital beds and ammunition canisters and weapons holsters just stuff like that anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video <laughs> remember to share with your friends and like comment and subscribe i guess i will see you guys later peace